My name is Dr. David Provost, and you're watching the Weight Loss Surgery Channel. Hello and welcome to WLS News. I'm Leslie Thompson and thanks for joining us today. We have several interesting stories lined up for you in today's show, including a report about whether some people are born with food addictions and a comparison of the effectiveness of behavior modification versus bariatric surgery to achieve long-term weight loss. And of course, our own bariatric girl, Yvonne McCarthy, will give us her latest report on one of the coolest weight loss surgery sites on the net. All of that is coming up, but first, we have an interesting story about the growing trend of obesity among America's immigrants. A 2004 study by the American Medical Association found that the body mass index, or BMI, of the average immigrant increases the longer that he or she has lived in the United States. In fact, data shows that the obesity rates for immigrants living in the U.S. for more than 15 years is 19%, compared to only 8% for those who have been here less than a year and younger immigrants are even more at risk of developing high BMI numbers the longer they live in the States. In other words, for many immigrants, gaining U.S. citizenship also means gaining weight. To address this trend, the National Institutes of Health has just given Tufts University a four-year, $2.3 million grant to design an obesity prevention program for immigrants. The program team will follow more than 400 pairs of mothers and their children who have lived in the United States less than five years. The mother's group will focus on making dietary changes and increasing physical activity to maintain a healthy weight, while researchers will concentrate on preventing weight gain in the children. If successful, the program will reduce the rate of obesity for its participants, and since people who weigh less are at a lower risk for developing serious medical conditions, like heart disease and diabetes, the study may help curb the cost of health care for taxpayers as well. Now, in our next story, we have some good news for those of you who have managed to stick to your New Year's resolution. It turns out that cutting calories can not only trim your waistline, but also boost your memory as well. A new study from the University of Münster in Germany showed that seniors who ate a healthy, reduced-calorie diet not only lost weight, but had significantly improved brain function. In the study, a group of normal to slightly overweight women ages 50 to 80 were given a verbal memory test. 20 of the women were then placed on a diet that reduced their daily caloric intake by 30% for three months. Another group increased their intake of unsaturated fatty acids while the remaining women ate their usual amount of calories. The results showed that the women on the reduced calorie diet not only lost weight, but also gained an unexpected 20% increase in their scores on the memory tests. Meanwhile, the women in the other two groups showed no increase in their verbal memory. Researchers suspect that the women who cut calories became more sensitive to insulin and a reduction in the molecule called C-reactive protein, both of which have been linked to an increased brain function. A leaner diet also cuts the risk of obesity and type 2 diabetes, which can increase the risk of Alzheimer's disease. But doctors say that seniors shouldn't try to lose too much weight too fast because it can increase your risk of malnutrition and also the risk of falls and fractures. They note that getting regular exercise can have the same positive effect on brain function while also helping you to burn those extra calories. Coming up after the break, we'll find out whether some people who suffer from obesity are simply hardwired to overeat. And Yvonne McCarthy will share this week's pick for one of the best weight loss surgery sites on the web. Stay where you are and we'll be right back. The Weight Loss Surgery News brought to you by Bariatric Advantage. Ask about the Advantage Reward Program because you deserve it. After weight loss surgery, it can be hard to get enough vitamins and nutrients in your diet. Bariatric Advantage offers a complete line of nutritional products specifically formulated to meet the unique needs of bariatric patients. Choosing to have weight loss surgery was a big decision and required a big investment. Learn how Bariatric Advantage nutritional supplements can help you get the most from your surgery by keeping your new body healthy and strong. Call us toll free at 800-898-6888 or visit us online at bariatricadvantage.com. Craig Thompson once weighed 400 pounds. Then he discovered hope. 
Whether you're considering weight loss surgery or you're on the road to recovery, Craig Thompson has been there. Join Craig each day for 90 seconds of advice and encouragement, 90 seconds to success, only on the Weight Loss Surgery Channel.